Hi, I'm Caitlin, a job dispatcher for Midstate Air. Today I'm going to show you how our company uses smart service to schedule, dispatch, and complete jobs every day. Let's start by looking at the scheduler. Here you can see the plan for each day this week. Each of these columns represent a day of work for one of our technicians. The jobs themselves are color-coded by city. Midstate Air? Hey, this is Benjamin Parsons. My building is having some air conditioning problems. How soon could you send someone out? If I look at the scheduler, I can see that I have openings on both Thursday and Friday. I'll schedule this job for Josh, one of my best technicians. To do this, I'll just left click and highlight across the time I'd like to allocate for the job. Then I'll right click and select New Job. I'll enter my customer's information, and Smart Service will take me into the job profile. Since Benjamin is a longtime customer, all of his information is already listed. If I click on the Instructions and Additional Contacts tab, I can write instructions for my technician, Josh. Saving this job will dispatch the work order directly to Josh's mobile device. Hi, I'm Josh, a service technician at Midstate Air. Today, I'm going to show you how I use Smart Service to complete work in the field. When I open the Smart Service mobile app, the first thing I'll see is my schedule for the day. If I tap on the map next to a job, I can get turn-by-turn -turn directions from my current location to the service address. Let's take a look at my first job. Here are the notes from Caitlin, my dispatcher. Looks like a simple AC repair. If I need to, I can review my customer's contact info, service history, or equipment information. Before I start traveling, I'll change my job status to traveling to job. This will send my customer a text message telling them I'm on my way. Once I arrive, I can indicate that I've arrived at the job and that I've started working. All this information will sync back to the office, helping our dispatchers keep track of my progress. After I diagnose the problem with my customer's air conditioner, I can add line items to start building up the invoice. Once I finish working, I can collect a signature and payment from my customer. I can then email my customer a copy of the invoice. At this point, my job is done, my paperwork has been completed, and the results have automatically synced back to the office. That means it's time for me to move on to my next job. Let's take a look at Josh's work in Smart Service. From here, I can verify all the information Josh entered. When I hit Post, the invoice will pop up in QuickBooks, complete with the customer's payment information. Pretty simple, right? Go to SmartService.com to request your demo today.